I don't like about this keyboard is that the keys kind of run into the other keys. But this is probably the best keyboard that I have. It's really nice. All these keyboards my friend Todd got for me at the Goodwill where he works. So he gets them right off the truck. So we got dibs, we got dibs on really good stuff that's used up. And I like that kind of stuff, stuff that's a little rough to a lot rough and you can probably tell that that's the way that I carry myself sometimes I watch this channel and I still can't believe I'm doing it and I know that it's a sacrifice even if you don't know Everything's a sacrifice If you have kids, that's a sacrifice Or if you choose not to have kids That's also a sacrifice And back in the day If you were a barren woman You would be shamed by society weren't a virgin, you were as good as dead to society, but we know, I'm pretty sure everybody knows, that the apple has fallen quite far from the tree. that it has with me but hey it brings me closer to the one that made me so if people find that weird if they think that they fuck I fucked that up find that weird that I relish all the stuff that makes me weird that I relish all the stuff that makes me ashamed that I relish all the stuff that most of the society that we live within They'd be so afraid, they'd be so afraid When are they not afraid of what's inside of them? The stuff that's lurking underneath all the stuff that they Use so they don't have to face The trauma of their childhood The trauma of America, ha 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 ha, the trauma of being so systemized, institutionalized, all for the purpose of being popular, all for the purpose of being important. I guess I always knew that that was never something I would ever live up to. So I stopped. I decided to stop. I chose to stop because I knew that I would never meet their demands. 
So I decided to meet my own instead And if that makes me selfish So be I just love that. I'm sorry. You you can hate it all you want. I love doing it. I just love to sing. See? What I was just talking about. That's what keeps happening. Like, the keys just, like, run into each other. Maybe you just suck. Maybe you just suck at playing piano. You ever consider that? Oh, more than... More than you think I consider that. <laughs> I'm sure that people have to assume that I don't have self-awareness All because I don't seem to care how silly I look Or how arrogant I sound Honey, I watch all of this. I watch all of this. Somebody left a comment today. <laughs> he said this was hard. <laughs> I know, baby, I know. I told you. I told you it was bad. I said that in the title. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's, the, it's the video that I did that was like really terrible piano punk or something like that. It was like a really long video. It was like 30 minutes long. All throughout the video, I was like, don't put this up, don't put this up, don't put this up. But, like, by the end of it, I was like, you have to put it up. And the reason I do that is because, like, we live in a society that is so obsessed with its image. And people are so afraid of looking stupid. Like, these, the, this, this theme that I'm going with tonight is, like, how people that are afraid of looking stupid or sounding stupid are really boring and lame and they don't really say anything that matters because they're so afraid of taking a risk, you know? And the biggest risk that you can take, apparently, I don't think it is, but it is to other people, obviously, that, that you're going to look stupid and you're, you're going to be hated by society or people are going to think that, that you're, you're an idiot or you're just ridiculous or you're crazy or whatever. It's like, People are so afraid of, of what society is going to think, you know? But it's like, fuck society. Fuck society. Y'all motherfuckers chose the internet. You chose the internet. Your fucking government tracking device is constantly listening to you. It's selling you bullshit. That's what you chose voluntarily. You made the choice to do that. Okay? I did not make that choice. Fuck you. Fuck you. This is the sound of not making that choice, bitch. This is the sound of not making that fucking choice. And everybody else... We go on these rants multiple times a day, multiple times an hour we go on these rants. You choose the things that make your life bad. You choose the things that make your life bad. And you'll never see it, you don't want to see it, that's why you hate profits, that's why you hate profits. You don't want to see it, you don't want to see it, that's why you hate profits, that's why you hate profits. Is it arrogant for me to call myself that? Honey. All this stuff is obvious if you pay attention to the nation you live in. All this stuff is obvious if you pay attention to what's on the television. All this stuff is obvious if you pay attention to your civilization. You know, I don't call it that. Demoralization. That's what it is. And I'm not holier than thou, like I said, unholier than thou, okay? But that's why I can make these assessments. You know, I gotta tell on myself first, I gotta throw myself under the bus so that I can throw everybody else under the bus.